submerged myself in it. I only went out at night. My search became obsessive, but I still had no idea what I was looking for. in the shadows. Fear of the dark is really just fear of what could be that... that vast, paralyzing ocean. But photography... can freeze reality in a snapshot. Put a cage around the infinite and capture it. I need to prove those faces are really there. script of a novel. Return. A horror story about the dark presence escaping from the dark place, taking over Bright Falls. I couldn't remember writing it. I had not written it. I would never write this. I knew who had. Scratch. A monster with my face. If this story came true, Scratch would get out, people would die. Destroying the manuscript, it wouldn't stop it from happening. I would have to fix it, edit it. I could not change the genre of the story. I'd have to work within the constraints set by Scratch. I needed someone in the story to fight the darkness. Saga Anderson. I kept seeing her in my visions. She was already in Bright Falls, already involved, but she was not in return. Not yet. I'd write her in, try to stop Scratch within the limits of the horror story. It was almost impossible. It was taking too long. I had not reached the end. finish my edits to the manuscript. The memory of my edits was already fading. Terrible things would happen if the manuscript came true. Scratch was there, at Parliament Tower, undoing my work. He could use the story to escape. He could go after Alice. Zane had said we worked on Return together. That was a lie. Scratch wrote Return. I would pay Zane another visit. He had guided me to two murder sites. I needed a new one to get back to Parliament Tower. A new draft of initiation.
It could not be opened on the side.
I'm Saga Anderson, FBI. I can hear you. Cauldron Lake. Yes, sir. I'm at Cauldron Lake. Where are you? I'm not to escape. In danger. The dark presence. Are you okay? No, no! It's my fault! They got out with my face! Scratch! Sir, calm down. I'm gonna need you to take a breath. He's... he's changed the story. The, the dark presence. We must stop it before... Easy now. First things first. What's your name? My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. I, I've been... Wake? Where did you come from? You've been missing for 13 years. 13. Sudden, the radio stopped working, and then that flooding just disappeared. Crazy forest. Is this who I think it is? Casey, say hello to Alan Wake. Mr. Wake, this is Special Agent Alex Casey. He'll escort you to our car. Casey, I'll meet you there right after I take a look around. If the flooding's receded, there might be evidence we missed earlier. Okay. See you there.
they won't be coming back. Alan Wake. <laughs> My name comes up, your books come up, you come up. I've read them. There are echoes of my life in there that makes me feel like someone's been watching me. What happened to Alan Wake? The unanswered mystery. Never expected to find you alive. Oh, my head's killing me. I think you like using people, Wake. Taking their lives and twisting them into your stories. And when someone gets hurt, it's kick-ass material for the next one. Shit! Spilled my coffee. <sighs> Take it you're not a fan, then, Agent Casey. This is not your playground, and I'm not your fucking creation. It doesn't work that way. You can't make something out of nothing, even in the dark place where the... Rules hardly apply. It's very complicated to make fiction come true. I saw visions of what's happening. What will happen? Dreams. I try to use them in my writing. I understand how dangerous it is now. Even with a paralyzing amount of planning. I think I stopped writing. I think I gave up. 
But there's a manuscript. Maybe I forgot not to write. The dark place makes you forget. I just want to fix this. Find a version of the story that fixes everything. Shut up! Get down! FBI! We want the rider! No one else needs to get hurt! Fuck off!
The FBI. Saga Anderson. I'm closer now. I can feel it. You help me get closer to escaping. Wait. Where are you? Is this coming from the dark place when you were still trapped? I have the clicker. We can finish this. What about the clicker? You can help. We must find it. I already have it. I can get it to you. But I have to understand. Did you write Logan into the story? Black in danger. I need to get back. I'm writing a story. It's the only way. Then change the story. If this is the past. If this is you, still in the dark place, then you can do that, right? You cannot write her in! She's my daughter, goddammit! Logan is in the story. I can get him to change it. I have the clicker. I'll make him change it now. He had no right to do this to Logan. To my family. Oh, oh, fucking hell. Are you okay? Uh, hey, it took your sweet time to come save your grandpa, huh? Uh. Nice attitude. A family trait? Uh, uh, you're right. Sorry. Thanks for helping out an old bastard like me. That's my job. Now, I've got some questions for you. <laughs> of course you do, sweetie pie. <laughs> and I got answers. <laughs> Look in the mirror. We need to talk. <sighs> Get him right.
rock and roll. Yeah, they hey, are. I'm you here. Know, I'm, you, I'm here. Let's get ready. Anderson, we've set up a control center up here over to the area. Anderson, I can drop more gear down for you for running low. I'll use the lights to hit the taken when they come. Light them up for you. Bad news is we were in a hurry. The power supply is spotty. Your partner here will try to keep it running. But I, I'm not a damn mechanic. I wish your tech guy was here, Karen. Just like old times, right, bro? Fighting the force of darkness with heavy metal!
What happened? Why didn't it work? I did everything right. Art to bring him back? Clicker to make it real? So where the fuck is he? presence had stopped me. I had seen the title page of another manuscript. Return. I didn't remember writing it, but it felt familiar. Important. I had to find it. a new draft of initiation to reach Parliament Tower using another murder site. Scratch was reaching out. Filmmaker Thomas Zane, an esoteric bohemian with a hard on for acts of cruelty performed in the name of occult nonsense. A director wants to control every aspect of the world in their films. Is a cult leader any different? Was Zane just another alias? for Scratch. There was a rumor that Wake and Zane had been working on something together. I was going to get the truth out of Zane, whatever means necessary. Zane's room, 665, was upstairs. The elevator would take me there.
Something told me Zane wouldn't be happy to see me this time. I'm in control now. The second you try anything, I will shoot you in the head! Scratch wrote return, not me! You're a fucking liar! You'd given up. You stopped writing. You said it was too dangerous, that, that we didn't deserve to get out. And then he showed up. Scratch. He promised to write. To get me the hell out of here. He was magnificent. Visionary. I mean, it was art. And then, when he finished, he took a return and left me behind. It's still here. And so is he. I know I fucked up. But you can still catch him before he gets out. Before he gets to your wife. And when you get to him, don't hesitate. Kill the bastard for what he did to us. There's a murder site in my cinema where my film Nightless Night is playing. I told you not to try anything! I had to find the movie theater Poet Cinema. The next murder site was there. Zane had created the film in tandem with Return to escape the dark place.
You don't need to tell me this is a horror story. Right. The ending has to fit the genre if it's going to work. In a horror story, there are only victims and monsters. There must be a way to bring a hero into the story. If there is a hero, they will ultimately pay a heavy price. I can't let the horror story take Logan and Casey. They were dragged into this. They need to survive. Non-negotiable. Not just them. We need to try to save everyone. I have an idea how to help Casey. He's a real person who I twisted into a character. He isn't my creation, so he isn't a suitable host for the Dark Presence. I can write that into the ending to drive that fucking thing out of him. So the ending has to be earned, set up by the story. You can't build a case without supporting evidence. That's the only way to make it stick. Well, if the ending has to fit the story, this is how I see it. Return is a story about a story that comes true. And I'm a character in the story. Not just a character. The hero. Okay, a hero. <laughs> in any case, I've been through hell to be here. And this is my life. It feels earned to me that I rise above the story and be there to create the ending. Yes. That's what we're doing. Here, now. We're figuring out the ending I need to write. This isn't Scratch's ending. But this isn't your ending either. This is our ending. You aren't the only one deciding these things anymore. You're right. I can't do this alone. Every time I write, things only get worse. You beat this thing back in 2010, Alan. And here you are doing the same again. You're a hero too. We're in this together. Then let's bring it home. The ending will have to be dark, no matter what. The more people we save, the greater the cost, and the hero must pay the price. One of the heroes. The scales always need to balance. <sighs> Fuck it. Let's go with this. Are you sure? There's no time for anything better. Scratch could be here any second. Then that's our ending. I have the clicker. I'll find a way to get it to you. And I'll get the pages down. See you on the other side. The ending we talked about. I have the clicker and the bullet of light. Let's do this. I have to be the one to do it. I feel like I've always been on this journey. Okay. It must end here, this darkness. What lies under the surface now shifts. A play of shadows catching my eye, thrusting my face into the water. He's here. It's shockingly cold. Past the mirror of the surface. <laughs> Now. A white searing light.
light of truth that for a flash pierces the shadows and reveals the hidden horror. And in that moment of silence, the whispered message finally heard. Another dream to wake up from, always coming back to the beginning. The memory of what came before burned away by this terrible realization. Maybe it's a mercy, forgetting. To know nothing when we loop around, back to the... Anderson. 